Hey guys, welcome back to Jibber Jab Reviews. I want to start off the review actually by thanking all of you for your support and for participating in our giveaways and leaving comments. And I also want to apologize if I don't get to answer everyone's comments. I try to reply to as many as I can, but as you can see, the Jibber Jab family is exploding now. So it takes me more time to get through them all. So please be patient and of course help each other out with information as well because this is a community and it's all about supporting each other. Okay, in today's show, I have three watch faces to show you guys from a brand new developer. And all these faces definitely have a more modern style to them. So I hope you guys like them. And I always like being able to share new talent with you too. So you'll have to check out his entire collection when you have some time. And as usual, I'll also be selecting eight winners in our giveaway contest, whereby you can pick from any one of these watch faces and the developer's gonna provide you with a coupon code to download on for free. Okay, let's go check out these new faces from this new developer to the show. Okay guys, now the faces I'm gonna show you today are highly customizable, so I think you're really gonna be blown away when you see how much choices you have here. This first face is a hybrid version with the digital time shown there right in the center, and that can also be set in a 12 or 24 hour format. And the fun really starts when you click on that small gear icon on the right hand side as a menu option appears and it gives you the ability to make a wide range of changes to the look and style of the face. You can change the colors of the hour and the minute hands, the index markers and text around the bezel, the color of the center display area, as well as the background screen. And all these changes can be made independently of each other, which gives you more combinations than you will ever need in your entire life. Now besides all this customization, you also have a variety of display features and activity information, and all this is shown through a rotation function so that every few seconds you get details displayed on the left and the right hand sides to show your moon phase, month, week, and day count, your total steps count and goal, your distance moved, floors climbed, heart rate, as well as your calories burnt. And right at the top of the face, you're gonna see there's red dots displayed there, and those actually depict the amount of power you have remaining. And lastly, this comes preloaded with a number of useful fixed app shortcuts as well as two customizable shortcuts. Okay, next up is another hybrid watch face, although this one has a more luxurious look to it than the previous one, and it also has a large font for the digital time, which makes it very easy to read. Now this one has customizations options just like the last one, so you're going to be pleasantly surprised to see that this face also includes a menu option to be able to make all those changes here too. So you can make changes to the hands, the bezel and backgrounds, or you can add or remove a mesh-like texture in the background. It also has similar functionality for displaying your activity information. So in that LCD panel at the bottom, you can see your floors climbed, your distance traveled, your last recorded heart rate, calories burned, as well as a day and week count of the year. Your battery status gauge is located in the same spot as the previous face, as you can see by those red blocks along the top right of the bezel. And lastly, this one comes with an equally good selection of fixed and custom app shortcuts. Okay, and the last one I want to show you is a weather-focused hybrid watch face. Now, this is the Celsius version that I'm showing you, but you can also pick this up in a Fahrenheit model as well. And although you don't have that gear menu on this face to give you the same level of customization as the previous two faces, you still have nine different color themes for the changes in the bezel here. Plus, you get some very specific weather information, which of course is the focus of the face. So at the top, you have the digital time as well as a battery status. Then in the bottom half, you have the full date as well as the current local temperature, the humidity level, as well as the current weather type. And I know many of you in the past have requested more information on weather related faces. So I think this one would be a great one to pick up because it gives you instant access to weather details. Plus, when you tap on that panel, it also opens up your weather app where you can see even more information. And lastly, like the other faces, you also have tap access to other apps, including both fixed and custom varieties.
And if you want more information on the watch faces that I reviewed today, then simply do a search in the Galaxy App Store under the name of these faces. I've also included the direct links in the video description. And I'm also going to be giving away coupon codes to random viewers that comment here, as well as coupons to random registered users on the Watchface community website, mygalaxywatch.com. So you have two chances to win, both here and on the website, but remember that you have to be a registered user in order to participate, so make sure you go sign up. As always, good luck to everyone, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Thanks again for watching our review, and if you liked it, then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and share the video with your friends, because with your support, it helps me keep the channel going so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways, and of course, fresh content. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then, take care.